What is up everyone, this is ZoraKing090 and this is going to be week number 7 of the progression video of myself working out for the summer. The main goal is for myself to have a better body, a better lifestyle, more stamina, just overall better habits. So, with this week's coming up, that what I want to do is actually get myself the total gym out of the area because one of the things is is that my father had the total gym he was giving it to a friend who didn't even use it anymore so we literally got a free total gym and he used it after he got his surgery because when he had his surgery he got his kidneys taken out he got a brand new kidney and with that of course he lost some weight but at the same time he became incredibly weak so he actually had to build himself back up again just doing little exercises little exercises then became more strenuous and as well as better exercises or bigger exercises, I don't know what it's really called, just more and more and more until that he actually became to his old self again or his normal self again and then afterwards it's like nobody else was using it so he had to put it away for a while and now it's just collecting dust sitting over there and now I want to actually use it. I can't believe I didn't even thought about this sooner because I could actually do my upper body workouts with that easier when I'm having my back on the thing and then I'm using my own weight as the weight itself so I could actually use that. Just not let it go to waste, right? So not only I'll be able to use the total gym, I'll be able to use the rack and as well as the ab roller for different exercises so that it could actually be just different. Not having to do the same routine every single day, just something different for some other things so that it's just not going to become boring. That's all it is. I got to keep changing it up for myself. Otherwise, then I'm just going to be bored of it and then I will not actually have more motivation to do it. It kind of sucks of how I am. If I start something and if I don't do something for a while, then it's harder for me to get back to it. So I just got to change things up a bit so that it'll help me in the long run. Because my friends and I are in a competition so that whoever gets the best before and after results will win the pool money. So far it's me against six other people so it's pretty much everyone against six and the pool money is at $120 right now and we have three months to do it. September 1st is going to be the deadline so that's going to be the end of summer and that's going to be the deadline and let's see who has the best before and after results and whoever wins gets $120. Best motivation to actually work out and pretty much all it is is that whoever is actually dedicated to the actual competition has the results to show for it so if I don't have the best results that just means I didn't actually work as hard as I should have and everybody else is just kind of the same thing if we actually worked the hardest but still lost at least we have the body to show for our commitment and our actual work towards the competition and in the end that's still a win in my book if you're just gonna have to lose twenty dollars because of that but just as long as you actually did the competition and actually work towards and you have a good body for it then at least that's a reward for itself so great motivation you should actually compete with other people to see who's going to get the better body that's all i can really say if you're very very competitive that's one of the things that will keep you moving and keep you driving to actually become the best this is why athletes always train and train and train because they always want to win and knowing that everybody else is going to train they're going to have to keep on doing it so that they can become the best so if athletes can do it, then the normal person can actually do it. Just the competition in itself is a motivator to actually start doing things. So that's all I can really say. Mainly, I got the ab roller. It's actually pretty good. Gotta have a lot of balance with that. Got the rack, be able to do some other upper body strength. And as well as I'm going to use a total gym for the, all the other exercises. All the other exercises, if I could actually talk with proper grammar and proper English correctly so that it's not going to collect dust there's going to be some use out of it and then just continue on working dedication commitment and just doing it so that's all it really is just got to remain healthy and all that good stuff and keep up with the good habits if you guys have been keeping up as well let me know what your progress is so far in the comment section below and if you've been lazy and you have been slacking off then it's okay because everybody does it i do it all the time so all it is is that you got to get back to it you got to have more motivation you can do it i believe in you you can actually do it and i'm going to try to become the better example in just actually doing it and just having that before and after to show for it i've already taken the pictures of it and now i'm gonna have to show you the after pictures and let's see if there's an actual change in it if there's not then i failed that's all i gotta say i do not want to fail i want to succeed so i want to actually be an inspiration for everybody else so let's go help each other through this you can do it help me do this and let's see where we're at where where we will be at in september 1st so that's all i gotta say let's do this guys so in any case if you have any advice for my workouts or any advice for nutrition, let me know in the comment section below and let's see if we can actually help each other out.
But until then, have a great day, everyone. I'm SoroKing090, and as always, I will see you in the next video.